So it turns out making a metal, simple metal detector is actually pretty easy. All you need is an old stereo like this. And if you bust open the speakers at the back of them, you'll always find magnets. So you get two for every old stereo that you're throwing out when you bust open these things. You can then apply this magnet to a metal handle like this one was taken off of a wagon. Just plop it in the center, like so. And now you have a very simple metal detector. Or better yet, as you get two of these little puppies with every stereo, is use the back of a hole. Yeah, there you go. You now have a very simple metal detector. And this is useful for large projects. After a large project where there's lots of nails and screws, like this one here with a tree house, um, these nails and screws very often are almost imperceptible and invisible mixed in with the grass around. But if you just hover with your magnetic wand over it, you can pick up all the loose screws and nails that are a threat to your kid's feet. Another real simple use is uh, finding boundary markers which are iron and over time often get hidden in thick underbrush. So once you know the general area where it should be, the gist of it, or you know by measurement where it should be, again, you just hover with your little magnetic wand and you should feel it tug when it gets over the iron. So this is a very simple, easy to do metal detector anybody can do at home. All you need is an old stereo and a hole or some other kind of metal extension and hopefully this will save your feet or your little one's feet and save you some hassle finding your, um, your boundary marks. Thanks for watching.